Damn it. All right, I need a I need a, a treasure chest or whatever. I need to go and like drop off my stuff. Oh, hi. Oh, for fuck's sake. Well, uh, this is a good way to get rid of some of those items. Oh, and all the zombies woke up. Good. The liquors in this are like beefier than they were in the PlayStation like original. Yeah, right? Like they used to be like way skinnier. They have another now they got that thickness. Okay, alright, we did it. Now we can pick up this guac trophy. Hi. All right, here we go. Wait, let me just look at... Uh. Guac Institute in the shape of a helix. There we go. Something's written on the bottom. Two, zero... Six, maybe? Two, zero, six, seven. Great. Thanks. It's not going to help me solve my Murph puzzle. Oh, it's the rest of the... It's the rest of the thing. Uh, it's the rest of the, the two, zero to get me the thing upstairs. Okay. Get hosed. Really? You're just gonna stand there and burn? There we go. Yeah, Vitamin, I don't think looking for logic in this game's like puzzles is a smart, it'll, madness that way lies. Hi. Same one. Get the fuck out of here. Somebody's note. Everybody's turned. Vegified. They keep coming back again and again. Burn them all. Burn them until their whole body is black as ash. There's no other way. Ash is like kind of gray, but okay. Ooh, it's time for the modulator. <laughs> It's time for the modulator. Okay, so I guess that's the thing that we use to figure out. Okay, all right. Game's really loading me up on stuff. Definitely need another sack banana. What is this? It's more fucking big boy ammo is what it is. Yes, a shortcut was opened. Okay, so now I can go back here and I can unload some of this stuff that I've got. Uh, let's. God damn it. Let's, I guess this thing. 
right back to the bonfire. <laughs> okay, there we go. That gives us two more. Two more slots. Um, and then there was a... It's a gunpowder here, I think, that I can pick up. Yep. And that can go... In there. All right. So now... Nope. Uh, I have not seen the new trailer, no. Uh, for, for Sekiro, I should check it out. I'm like, moderately excited. Like, we'll see. We'll see. Should I go... I shouldn't go back this way. I should go into the greenhouse, right? So that I can... Yeah. So back into the presentation room. Yeah, here we go. And then through here into the greenhouse control room. Really? It's coming out in six weeks? It's so soon. Why did I think it was going to be longer? <gasps> Ghost of Tsushima is going to be so fucking good, though. When is that coming out? I want that, like, now. Okay, two, zero, six. No, that wasn't zero. That was two, seven. Two, zero, six, seven. Okay, good, good, cool. Yeah, Ghost of Tsushima is still to be announced. Yeah, that game's going to be awesome. I mean, I hope. Maybe it'll be terrible, but I want it to be good, and I'm really excited. All right. Drug testing lab. Yeah, it was certainly the thing that I was most excited about that they showed off for from EA. Or from, uh, I mean, uh, E3. Okay, several grenades. Um, oh God, this is going to be a story item, isn't it? Oh, no, I have to plug the thing in. Okay. Okay. It's like a Towers of Hanoi. More like Tower of Annoying. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just, I'm just fucking around. All right, here, let's go. Uh... Okay, so now it's all full. Did I already have it? <laughs> God damn it. Oh well, we'll just keep. I wasn't even trying, I was just dicking around with it. Deep, deep, deep. And that's gonna be too much now. The goal is to fill it just to the red line. This is so stupid that this would ever even exist. And then I just need like a tiny amount in the other one. <laughs> oh, how infuriating.
Uh, okay. Like, um... What? I had it again? No, I didn't. Where? How? I'm so confused. Why didn't it stop then? Yeah, like... So now I have two of these that are the same, the same, like, amount. No, all right, god damn it. Uh, ramp, ramp. All right, so I have two that are the same now. So let's just here, let's go like this. We'll just fill this big tube all the way up. Okay, and then we'll take the, the big amount. Okay, now I have a tiny bit in the big tube. And I need to switch switch these, right? Okay. <laughs> So now the, this, this, no, uh, wait, these two together should make that one. Yeah, there. So I didn't have it. I just didn't. It was okay. Yeah. So stupid. I hate it. The stupidest. <laughs> Though it's good that I got it when I actually tried instead of just like dicking around with it. Okay. All right. Um... This is that note that I didn't see. Place an empty container. Add the required amount. Cool immediately. Okay, so I didn't cool. I didn't cool it. Where's the coolant machine? Where do I? What do I do to cool it? Is there a cooler? I have a flamethrower. That's the opposite. <laughs> Say a sick one-liner. Ah, oh, you're so cool, and it instantly just, like, chills out. What if we flamethrower everything around it? Yeah, why wouldn't the cooler just be right next to the machine? You'd fucking think, wouldn't you? Do I still need that guac trophy? Yeah, maybe there's like a fridge in the that break room that I was in or some shit. Here, let me go ditch the trophy. Cuz it's just going to tell me it was the wrong temperature, right? So Let's go back to that other area. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. All right. Here we go. All right. So I don't need you. Oh, that's like Dunzo forever. Okay. And I don't need this regular gunpowder right now. And everything else will go down as I use weapons. Okay. All right. Yeah, I haven't. You don't actually use the trophy. You just need the number underneath it. So it had that little that thing. Okay, so where do I cool down? Hmm. Well, there's a circuit breaker. Let's here, let's go let's go down to the break room anyway. Oh god, the bug sounds remind me of uh, Dishonored. It was the second one that had those like weird bug swarms, right? Uh, and then this way. Okay.
grass types are weak to fire. It's true. So there's something else in this hallway I haven't got yet. Here we go. What's this? Oh, good. The map. Fantastic. <laughs> now we get it. Low temperature testing lab. There we go. That's where I got to go. Sick. I'm on the right track. We're doing it. Doing it, everybody. Okay. Perfect. <laughs> uh, can I fuck with it? Oh, I sure can. Thank you for coming to my show. Buy a t-shirt. <laughs> okay, so I got to get the waves to like match up and then do the okay all right let's get murfed so left dial and right dial that's close in some places i did it murfed yeah <laughs> thank you we are murf Ladies and gentlemen, from Berlin, Germany, Murph. All right. Fucking. So what did the, the fucking thing do? Can I go back to the server room then? Here we go. We're gonna go to the server room. Get the dirt fruit. Gotta go get my bracelet because I don't have it because I put it in the box. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, yeah, yeah, charm quirk. That's what we're doing. Gotta go get that bracelet. Man, stupid old Fitbit. Ew. Ew. I could just, just burn his genitals right off. Gross. Ew. I want to do another Murph puzzle. That was fun. I was making weird noises. Yeah, they did say apply the cold immediately, huh? Well... <laughs> um, I have a, uh, I have a smart, I have a smart watch. I have an Apple watch and I have had it since, I don't know, Gen 1. Like, I've had it for a while. Um... Ask me anything. <laughs> Someone in uh, chat, if you're watching this on YouTube and you're like, what the fuck is Adam talking about? Why did that come up? Uh, Someone in chat asked about, about it. Um, okay, I could make, I have all this like regular ass gunpowder, but I want, I want to make good bullets and not just like baby wimpy bullets. So, so I don't know. Yeah, there is one more of those Murph things and I want to use it, but I can't remember where it is.
To check the podium computer? Yeah, they said I needed a different level of... Yeah, I need purple. I need, I need purple to get at it. I'm just an umbrella affiliate. I need to be an umbrella partner to have access to that computer. <laughs> Throwing bullets? Yeah, exactly. I can make sling bullets. You don't even need gunpowder for those. All right, back down we go. It's the hierarchy of bullets, right? Shotgun shells, mag bullets, nine millimeter bullets, fucking sling bullets. You know what I think, you know what I think people underestimate is, have you ever looked at like the size of an actual sling bullet? Like we think of them as like stones, like little little rocks, right? They're, they're like fucking baseballs. They're huge. Yeah, they're really big. So getting gooned by one of those, like, you are dead. Yeah. Because you can use a sling to throw them really hard. What's that? What's that thing that's like a stick with a sling on the end? Like an, it's not an atlatl, because an atlatl is a spear throwing device. It's like, it's like a sling staff, but there's like a name for it. Yeah, I think there's like, there's a different name. <laughs> Highlight. Man, Highlight is, Highlight is a fucking trip. That is a weird sport. Right, there's another knife in the server room. Oh, good. Yeah, I don't know. I might be thinking of something else, but. Let's put, let's just put this in here for a second. Take out this gunpowder, make some shotgun shells. There we go. Combine those with my existing... Nope, I don't have any existing shotgun shells. I just have a lot of mag ammo that I didn't combine for some reason. There we go. What the hell am I doing? Okay. Now I gotta get that wristband. There we go, there we go, there we go. Yeah, the Adelatl is a it's a hell of a weapon. Yeah, because it takes, it takes all the, the leverage you get out of a sling and uh, puts, it, uh, puts it in a... puts a spear on the end of it. And so it's like a, it's like a, um, a stick, like a waist high stick with a, a bowl on the end. And you put, I think it's like, um, South American, like a uh, indigenous South American weapon. And you put, you put a, a spear on it and you fucking throw the spear and it basically makes your arm twice as long, which means you throw the spear extra fucking hard. And it just like, just rips like they're, they're nuts. Yeah. Those are the same dudes that had, uh, because they didn't have, um, swords. They didn't have swords made out of, like, flattened iron, right, or steel or whatever. But they had, um, pieces of wood with, like, alligator teeth or, like, broken obsidian and stuff in them. So they're, like, saw swords. Yeah, the fucking, the Incas and the, the, um, the Aztecs and stuff, they make, they make knights look like... Like big lumbering babies. Yeah, they're they're intense. <laughs> yeah, it was obsidian. Yeah. Yeah, just hack it was like a like a weird serrated axe, basically. Yeah, they're the Inca and the Aztec and like pre um like pre Spanish uh South American culture is pretty cool. There's some like really interesting stuff going on there. Right, and the Ma Maori had shark teeth. That's probably I was probably conflating those two. Yeah, Maori like shark teeth Welcome clubs. Back, Dr. Lee. You have five new messages. First new message. Wayne Lee's Lil Wayne's inbox. Se uh, sender Rick Mendoza. What's he up to? Can you believe that bastard Cartwright? Cool your jets, asshole. Well, I guess he is the boss. For now, <laughs> anyway, have you seen my helix anywhere? I put the secret on the bottom. Let me know if you find it. Byron Cartwright. Busy guy, huh? So, you couldn't make our little meeting. Fine, don't worry about the greenhouse inspection. Instead, I'll give you something real simple to do. Put together the budget estimate for the year after next and get it done tonight. Rick Mendoza, are you still alive? We're under attack. People are dead. The east area is cut off. We can't operate the bridge with the wristbands we have. Where's that bastard Cartwright hiding? 
Plan 43 is going wild. The greenhouse is hell. We need to send someone in there before it's too late. Wayne, how do we stop this thing? You have to help us. Do you remember Susie, the cheerleader? What a great gal. We were both into her. Of course, she wasn't into nerds. I still have to give you back those comics and games I borrowed. But you might have to wait a while. If I had continued to read those emails, Rick would have just turned into strong bad. So it's good there were only five. Hey, buddy, how about that Cartwright? What an asshole, right? Man, science is great. Ugh. Who left the freezer open? Probably the same guy that let the dogs out? I don't... I don't know. Yeah, freeze the sample. How do you make the T-Virus with boxing gloves on? Uh-oh, everybody. <laughs> this system is down. <laughs> Man, I love that shit. Right, herbicide. Cooling complete. And creatine. Leon, how do you become such a tough and cool man? Well, I just put a big scoop of gunpowder in my morning smoothie and everything's A-OK. -okay. What would happen if you just ate a mouthful of gunpowder? Like, you just get really sick, right? It would just, you'd just barf. It would just be bad for you. But saltpeter, right? That's like that's a thing. Like, yeah, exactly. Like there's some there's something in it that like is medicinal. Okay, I'm going to take this knife and I'm going to put it in this box. Done. Okay. Now do I have I have red and blue herbs, but no green herbs of which to speak. Okay, that's fine. And then I've got another Regular type of gunpowder. Uh, oh well, that's okay. Yeah, I guess it depends on how much sulfur is in it, but it wouldn't be good for you. Alright, there you go. When ingested, you might convert some of it to nitric, o nitric oxide you'd want to lay down, but it wouldn't, like, kill you. Okay, alright. The question is, why would you eat gunpowder? The reason I said that is because it, the thing, the item in this game, the gunpowder, I don't have it in my inventory anymore, it looks like a big thing of, of like, muscle gain powder. Okay, let's go and free Nancy Cartwright. Uh, I gotta go, yeah, back to the control room. Dispensing solution now. Generally speaking, insufflating anything is just like not a pleasant experience. Cause you got all those sensitive mucus membranes. You don't wanna you don't wanna put stuff up there. That's that's a it's bad right. call. Oh no! Don't log my actions. God damn it, Cartwright! You might be thinking of a Merv, uh, Charm Cork, which is a something remote vehicle. M it's an M E M E R V. Explosive removal vehicle. Ah, uh, multiple independent re-entry vehicle. That's the Merv I'm thinking of. Yep, that's the one. Yeah. That's the, it like, it breaks up and the, yeah, okay, good. Good job, team, we did it, thank you. It's a thing for ICBMs, yeah. Oh, look who it is. What's up, fuck boy? Okay, bye. Oh, fuck. 
Ah! Yeah, murder's like a cluster bomb. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> okay, go, go, go. I think I just shoot him in the eye and run. All right, now I need to go get my, do I have my badge still? Yeah, I do, here we go. Combine. Let's go look at that computer in the presentation room. I have, yeah, the Mr. DMX mod where it plays that music every time he shows up. It's pretty good. William Birkin, inventor of the Birkenstock. Uh, when did Nest become a nest for spies? Three last month, another four this month, and those are just the ones we've caught. Step up security, Cartwright, or do you want to end up like your predecessor? Also, I'll be restricting access to the West Area. Ignore all requests from headquarters for information on G. Those suits contribute nothing to this project anyway. Herbicide dispersal by unauthorized employee. Aw, oh, it narked on me. Uh, swapping frames, me too. Mr. F. That show, like, weirdly did not hold up. Like, I, I went back and I rewatched all of Arrested Development, and, like, I would say, like, about a third of... A third of the jokes were still, like, funny. Everything else, I was kind of like, uh oh. This is not... Like, that... The whole... Yeah. It's not... Right? It isn't that good. There's a few funny things in it, but... Yeah. I mean, that's what happens, like, with comedy especially. Like, things just, there is a season, and then, and then there isn't. Okay, all right, so let's, let's crank this thing back over to the other side. Hopefully the G sample's up here. Lab digital video cassette. Oh, I'm sad that it's not the USS digital video cassette. Okay, so, oh, do I get to do another Merv? Sick. All right, here we go. Time for another sick jam. Get ready, everybody. Thank you. <laughs> I actually really like uh, The Good Place because uh, it introduces people to complex philosophy concepts that they wouldn't otherwise like care or know about. Um, that, that for me is really great, right? Chidi is the best. Got eyes on the G virus. Going in. I think I recognize that voice actor. Oh, I, that's right. The big slimy dude is Dr. Birkin. This is my life's work. I'm not handing over anything. We have our orders, Dr. Birkin. I'll ask you one more time. <laughs> Hold your fire! <laughs> Hold your... Hmm. Yeah, doesn't he get mutated or something? Or is that his daughter in a different game? Situation normal, all fucked up. That's correct, sir. Roger that. Just the samples, then. Right, it is him. Okay, I just, I couldn't remember. Oh, God, that case is all covered in blood. Yikes. Oh, 
Kulai Martinez walks backwards. Uh, all right, let's put that in our case there. 